So we are going live. Welcome, dear ones. Welcome. We are streaming in more than one place at one time. This is Rachel Cooley, angel therapy practitioner and angelic guidance mentor and certification trainer here with the Divine Impact Show with Rachel Cooley, here to bring you the blessings and the light with the angels in this beautiful space on the Divine Impact Show where spiritual women, soul of, soulpreneurs, healers, light workers, women also on their career paths who are spiritual, who are here to catalyze miraculous blessings for themselves and others with the angels. Welcome and angel blessings. So happy to be here with all of you live. And we're streaming in live now. I'm going to also make sure that we are streaming as well to my angel sisterhood group for divinely thriving women, which is a beautiful place where we come together with the angels. And that's growing group with 584 women in there now. So I want to make sure I'm streaming to the angel sisterhood as well, my group. And then we will continue on and I'll bring you our theme for today for the Divine Impact Show, which is on divine guidance, divine guidance with the angels and how sometimes we can have blocks to receiving clear divine guidance. So I welcome you, angel blessing. So happy to be here with each one of you. This is an amazing place where spiritual women who are feeling the call with the angels come together, whether live or on the replay, to receive the blessings and to receive a light with this incredible realm of the angels. And I'm so happy to be here with all of you live right now. So if you're joining me live in any place, I invite you to say hello in the comments so I know that you're there. And I'm also going to make sure that I'm streaming okay too my um let's make sure that i'm also streaming okay onto instagram because i think that my connection got a little bit funny there so let's continue on and reconnect we're reconnecting now dear ones to the divine guidance show and i'm hoping hoping that that's working on instagram looks like it is working yes it is working we're back i am streaming now here for you all. So welcome and angel blessings. So happy to be here with all of you live right now. And I'm going to redo my Instagram. It looks like Instagram is not happening very much right now. So let's get that going. Let's take care of that later. Let's do that. And let's do it again, going live on Instagram. All right. All right, so here we are catching up with the Divine Impact Show. Thank you, loves, for hanging in there with me with my technology. So happy to be here with all of you for my theme today of Divine Guidance with the Angels. So again, I'm Rachel Cooley. I'm in my 25th year of working with the angels, and it is my blessing to bring the blessings of the angels to support amazing spiritual women, soulpreneurs, and healers to receive the blessings and the light with the angels and also women who are on their career paths, women that are mothers tuning into this weekly show to be divinely inspired, to up-level your life and to make the impact that you're called to make in your leadership and your business in your unprecedented times with our theme today of divine guidance with the angels on the divine impact show with Rachel Cooley. So calling in the blessings and the light with the angels. So as we start out our show for today, I wanted to bring you a couple highlights um, from um, my Archangels workshop, the clearing and protection with the Archangels workshop that happened on Thursday last week. We came together um, on Zoom, amazing group of spiritual women to do a powerful clearing and protection experience, deep dive experience, along with learning more about the angels and the Archangels more in depth and how they can help us in our lives and how we can call upon them to clear our energy as well as to call in their incredible protection. One of my clients, Lydia, Lydia Ramirez, she shared with me, she was there at the workshop um, with this amazing group of spiritual women. And she um, shared with me a testimonial from that that I'd like to share with you. And she said, Wow, pure amazement in divine divinity, the death Rachel took us to with the angels. You had to have been there, she said. For me, I was in the ethers with the angels with a feeling of peacefulness. Oh, so beautiful. We received insights, downloads, and thoughts, as well as words and sentences to write out along with the feelings that we were experiencing. Some of the women, along with myself, expressed how they felt and what they took away from this incredible experience of pure love, enlightenment, relieving, took the weight off of Lydia's shoulders and for the women all who were there live with us and angelic energies plus so many more. 
And she said, Rachel Cooley has a divinely given gift with the angels. She's been working with the angels for now over 24 years. And by the end of this workshop, we knew and we had that we had cleared so many blocks and truly felt protected. It was a higher zone, a higher realm. It took me a while to come out of this euphoric feeling that I experienced and I felt. Thank you so much, Rachel Cooley, angel expert. Thank you, Lydia, for your incredible testimonial. Wow, such a powerful experience. And dear ones, if you wanted to attend that workshop and you were not able to, you still can catch the replay. You still can, can connect to that. It also, um, I'll be sharing in a little bit, you have the option as well as even though we're going into the third workshop in the series, you still have the opportunity to join the entire series as well as receive an angelic support session with me. So, so excited to support even more women with the angels. So dear ones, back to our show for today. Last week, our theme was on clearing our resistance to the change that we desire with the angels. And our focus for this week, which is our 19th episode of the Divine Guidance of Divine Impact Show with Rachel Cooley. I'm used to saying divine guidance because that is the name of my business and the theme for our show today. This week, our focus, dear ones, is on divine guidance and how we can have blocks to receiving clear divine guidance. And we're going to be talking about some struggles that many women experience when they're not receiving clear divine guidance and how um, that can be shifted. And let's talk about that. Let's talk about that today. Again, I'm going to check in with my comments just to make sure I'm in real time with my comments here. I am going to refresh my page on my Rachel Cooley page. I just want to make sure that I'm seeing real time comments here. Beautiful, beautiful, dear one. So as you arrive, please say hello in the comments so I know that you're here. And I just wanted to also just, I love to check in with my angel sisterhood group just to see if there's any comments there also. And we'll continue with our theme for today. All right. So we have a viewer. Welcome to whoever is watching right now. Welcome to angel blessings. So let's dive dear ones into our theme again around divine guidance and how we can have blocks to receiving clear divine guidance. So dear ones, what is divine guidance? Let's start out with that. Divine guidance is how the angels, how the divine, how God, the universe brings us messages, brings us divine guidance, brings us signs, brings us experiences to come together to guide us in our lives, to guide us on our paths, to guide us when we're making decisions and to help us as well to receive clear divine guidance, divine guidance as well on experiences that we've had, helping us in our lives in so many ways. But it can be really stressful as a lot of my clients have experienced when you're not feeling grounded, when you're not feeling like you're connected to your angels or to their messages for you. Can you relate? Can you relate to not feeling connected or not receiving guidance when you need it? Because you may be experiencing feelings of overwhelm, feelings of stress, feelings of fearful thoughts negative thinking that ruminates through your mind, or you may be questioning, am I worthy? These things can be happening. Am I worthy of receiving clear divine guidance? Also, sometimes what happens is when we're not grounded, when we're not feeling at peace, which the angels help us with so beautifully, we can feel out of sorts, not grounded, not focused, and not on purpose. Who can relate to that if you're not feeling connected to your angels or connected to their divine guidance? Hello, Pat. So glad you're joining me from South Africa. Welcome and angel blessings. Wonderful to have you here with us today. So yeah, so it can be feeling overwhelmed, stressed out, having fear-based thoughts ruminating through your mind. That's what happens when we're not grounded and we're not tapped into our divine guidance. And we are in more, as I like, as I refer to as um, more fear-based energies or connected more to the ego and going into ruminations, going into worst case scenario stories in our minds that is so easy for our minds to go to because our culture is pretty intense, as we all know. So sometimes we can get thrown off base as well by hearing um, the news or hearing th intense things are happening. Of course, it's important to know what's happening on the news. It's important to know what, uh, what events are happening in the world. So we know where to send our prayers, light, love, and support, but it can throw us off. 
So the angels support us to receive clear divine guidance, to receive their blessings, to receive their incredible signs to guide us in our lives. And when your inner channel, dear ones, and your sisters and dear women is blocked, it can be blocked with past hurts, with protected patterns that are there to keep you safe, right? There's a part of you that's wanting to keep you safe and not, want, not wanting you to, to change. And it could be that those pro protective patterns or even feeling distrustful can be throwing you off and not connecting you with your angels, not connecting you with your pure divine guidance. If you can relate to what I'm sharing, please share in the chat. If you can relate, say, I get it or I understand. Pat says, I agree. Thank you, Pat. Thank you for your share there. I appreciate it. Yes. And we feel, dear ones, so much better when we are connected to our angels and we are connected to our divine guidance. So through this realization here and when we receive clear divine guidance, knowing that we feel so much better, we feel divinely held, loved, supported, and we feel more trusting. Who would like to feel more trusting? If you would like to feel more trust in your life, more faith, type me in the comments. So I can know that you're following along with me. Yes. So beautiful and so powerful to feel this trust and to feel this incredible energy. Yes, it's amazing. I was just checking for any other comments. Thanks, Pat, for being here. So wonderful to have you live again on the Divine Impact Show. So dear ones, so when we feel clear, when we feel more divinely guided, things fall into place more and we're more connected to our divine guidance. So I invite you to join me along with the amazing and powerful Archangel of divine guidance. That is Archangel Gabriel to join me next Thursday, May 9th, 2 p.m. Pacific for the third session of my amazing series on the um, angel workshop series to support you to activate divine power in your life. So I invite you to join me with Archangel Gabriel for our incredible next workshop on our series of three workshops with the angels to clear your divine channel, to clear your divine channel, amazing women, so that you can receive clear divine guidance, so that you can feel more certain, more trusting, more filled with faith when you receive a clearing of your channel so you can receive through your channel being cleared through your channel being cleared, through that experience, receiving clear divine guidance to guide you in your life, to help you to make more um, certain decisions, to bring you more certainty, to help you as well, to expand your capacity, to expand your capacity to receive clear divine guidance and to discover your intuitive gifts, as well as to receive more clear divine guidance and trust your inner knowing with more certainty. And this dear ones will allow you to break free, to break free powerfully of being stuck in a rut, to break free from feeling confused or uncertain about your right choices, your right next steps in your life for your highest good. So if you are ready if you are ready, dear ones, to move into more of what you long for in your life, I invite you to join me for Activate Your Inner Oracle, and that is happening on Thursday, May 9th from 2 to 4 p.m. Pacific. The replays are also available for this workshop. If you're not able to join me live and you really would like to tap into this powerful life-changing workshop of Activate Your Inner Oracle, I invite you to register anyway. You can always catch the replay and your ones. There is the option still as well to join the entire series where we have brought the blessings of the angels to activate divine power with them. Starting off, we started out with Meet Your Guardian Angel. You can access a replay to that to have a powerful experience that I guide you through to meet your primary guardian angel and to receive divine guidance from your incredible angel and also to learn a lot about the angels as well as the archangels and how they support you in your life. You can also, through jumping into this series, you can access as well our clearing and protection with the Archangels Workshop, where we worked morally in depth with Archangel Michael. I shared the testimonial a little bit ago at the beginning of my video from Lydia, one of my amazing clients who's been working with me in the Angels since 2019. 
She's now in her fifth year of working with me in the angels. And she continues on because the blessings that have come to her in her life are so powerful. So you can also access that incredible workshop as well of um, the clearing and protection with the archangels and join us live if you are able to, depending on your time zone for activate your inner Oracle, which is happening a week from Thursday on Thursday, May 9th at 2 p.m. Pacific from 2 to 4 p.m. Pacific. I'm going to pop the link in your ones into the comments on my various pages. Thank you, Pat, for your participation and for your your comments along the way there. I really appreciate it. I popped in the link, dear ones, to the workshop for Activate Your Inner Oracle. And on that page, there is a link as well to access the entire series. So you have options. You have options. It's so beautiful. So you have that invitation there. And it really is powerful when we feel more confident in our divine guidance, when we feel connected to our angels, connected to the archangels, and the blessings that come to us are incredible. So dear ones, you have the invitation there. I'll be sharing um, that link as well in my Angel Sisterhood group and on my business page and on my YouTube page. And if you're joining me for the Divine Impact Show today on Instagram, hello to all of you on Instagram. You can go to my bio and you can click on the link to get more information. That'll take you to my event right page. All right, dear ones. So as we get ready to close out our show for today, all on Divine Guidance and the blocks that can be there to keep us from receiving divine guidance. And also with the invitation to join me for activate your inner Oracle with the amazing spiritual women that are already in the series to join us with the angels for this powerful experience with Archangel Gabriel, the archangel of pure divine guidance to support us, to clear our channel, to receive clear divine guidance in our lives, to make more confident in certain decisions, to feel more connected and divinely guided. And I'm so looking forward to supporting you all there. So let's close out our show for today, dear ones, with an angel prayer taking in a new fresh breath in, gently exhaling out, feeling held, loved, blessed, grateful, feeling supported with this incredible realm, knowing that they're with us each and every day and that through their support, you can be tapped even more into their blessings and light. So as we breathe in and exhale out, dear ones, let's pray. Thank you so much, dear God. Thank you so much, dear angels. Thank you, archangels, along with Archangel Gabriel, our archangel of divine guidance. Thank you for blessing us with your light, with your love. And thank you as well for supporting and for being with each amazing woman here, each dear one here, hearing this message now live or on the replay. Thank you for illuminating for all of us what is possible, what is possible when we tap into clear divine guidance, when we tap into and make room in our lives for your incredible support. And we thank you as well for guiding each amazing woman here into her beautiful next steps in her life with ease and grace and light and support, and also to follow her inner knowing to know what to do and what's right for her. And we are so grateful. And for what's right for him, what's right for all the dear ones watching my Divine Impact show, because we have so many people watching. And so it all is. Thank you, angels. Thank you, Archangel Gabriel. Amen, 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 and blessed be. Such a joy to be here with all of you live today, dear ones, or on the replay. In fact, if you're watching the replay on Instagram or Facebook, I invite you to hashtag replay. You're welcome, Pat. So I know that you've been here. Um, that would be lovely. And know that God and your angels are by your side. And remember that they are here to support us in our lives. And they always come through. It's such a joy and honor to be here with you for the 19th episode of the Divine Impact Show with Rachel Colloy. I'm sending you so much love, light, and angel blessings. I invite you to join me for our next show, which will be on again next week. And that will be on the 7th. Is that the right? No. Uh, I'm looking at my calendar. Yes, the 7th of May, the 7th of May. And I just saw that it's 1222, which is pretty nice, pretty cool angel number there of keep up the faith, perfectly divinely timed. So I'll see you next week, dear ones, for my next Divine Impact show. Again, know that you're always surrounded by your angels, that they're always by your side. And with your request for support and help, they're always there and they always come through. And we are so grateful 
for their miraculous blessings. Have a great day, dear ones. Have a great rest of your week. Many angel blessings. I look forward to seeing you next time for the Divine Impact Show. And I look forward to seeing you then. Thanks again, Pat, for being here with me live from South Africa, sending everyone so much love, light, angel blessings. I'm going to be going off live on Facebook, and then I'll be going off live on Instagram. Mwah. Take care, loves, angel blessings, and I'll see you next time. Take care and bye for now on Facebook.